you're going to cut your own hair, you're going to need a mirror. I'm very fortunate to have an awesome one. I had a crazy Irish carpenter that lived right on the other side of my wall. Uh, he and I built these places out together. Uh, they were pretty much abandoned when we moved in, so we put in all kinds of stuff. But have we had all these Murphy bed doors from the year 1900 pulled out of an old apartment building in San Francisco. Here's one right here. It's a hundred and some year old mirror. I should clean this really quick and then I gotta go find a chair. I think a piano stool will do just fine. Don't cut your hair on any of the amplifiers they have sitting around. Awesome amps don't like hair. But guys with awesome hair play awesome amps. It's weird, right? The universe is weird. So now I'm gonna pull the rug up because I don't feel like trying to get hair out of the rug. And I can just shop back it up, make it easy. Cleanup's a snap. Do you know, like, you ever talk to hairstylists? They even get hair splinters. You know, you can get hair splinters. You there, Fancy? Fancy, are you there? I am now Fancy. here. Fancy. All right. Um, we have a uh, issue, and it's my hair. <laughs> <laughs> That's not my problem. All right, so you're gonna have to, um, you don't have to do anything, but uh, I would love it if you would talk me through um, making this Spelt. Uh, for a price, <laughs> and yes, okay, we can do right, this. Cool. You need you're you're gonna need some tools right. though. So right. open your okay, care package. Okay, I have a care package. All right. Let's see. So I have rat tail comb. Yes, very important right. rat tail comb. Um. I have well, I have multiple combs. These were one of the first things that my dad. I was in a bunch of elementary schools and one of the first things my dad ever taught me is if anyone ever messes with you you make sure that you just grip this in your hand and you shove it in their ear and you just keep stabbing until they stop hurting you that was lessons from my dad to a little three-year-old um i have some alice lorraine your homemade handmade um main detangler do i need that okay yes right. that head of hair is okay. gonna need that Yes. Um, what else do I got? What, what else did you give me? You gave me these. What are these for? These are tiny guys. Tiny guys. What are these for? You've got two different kinds of clippers. Yes. That's that's going to be for the detail around the edges. So like the around the top of your ear and the bottom of your hairline, right. because the other ones are larger, so they're going to cover more surface area. And since your hair is it's quite voluminous. It hasn't been cut in 12 months. You have a bunch of clips. Can I tell you a story about this? <laughs> okay, tell um, me a story about a round brush. <laughs> uh, when I was a, when I was young, I had like hair down to my butt, and I remember rolling one all the way up to my uh -oh. head, and it just stuck. Yeah. And it took a very long time to get out. Yeah. Um, so. Did you cut it out, or did you get it out? Situational awareness. No, I just little patience and nothing to do. Now, yeah, if you had had some it. main detangler, it would have come out a lot faster. All right, that's cool. Thank you. <laughs> Before we get started on this, do I need to like have wet hair? Do I need to have dry hair? I don't have one of those little smock smock things. What are those called? Barber bit? Is it a barber bit? Smocks. Cutting cape. Um, I don't have one of those, so I sh I'm going to um, get on something that I just I'm okay getting a lot of hair on. Not okay. good. <laughs> you're, you're gonna need to tuck the collar in on that. Oh, okay, so that might be in the way when you get to cutting the back. Okay. Well, I'm not we doing can, this shirt. We can, we can try it I'll out. I'll try it. I mean, maybe I can tuck it down like this. How's that, I'm, how's that feel? I'm pretending that this is gonna You feel like you can help. access the nape of your yes. head now? Yeah, okay. Okay. All right, so then I, 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 I detangle my mane. I mane detangle. Take yes. Is it okay to get on my jacket? Yes, it's organic. You make this. What's in it? 
it's it's a it's a combination of oils and hydrosol water hydrosol is the water that's left behind after you distill plant matter into essential mm -hmm. oils marginalized water yeah. does it oh so it smells bad to you oh, it doesn't smell bad i'm just I'm, I'm in it i'm in it i'm living it right now every no your stuff smells good yeah wait let me get underneath my hair's like a beaver doesn't uh doesn't allow for water to penetrate it spirit animal is either a beaver or well, an otter shoot more. that looks good sleekly through your hair yeah you All don't right, need a cut now Baby boy's popping. Do you have a reference photo of what you want your haircut to look like? Um. Yeah, here I'll text you. What haircuts are trending in the martial arts I'll world? See the guy. Whatever cut Keanu Reeves has. But his reference photo was Jason Momoa <laughs> with hair about as long as mine, I maybe a little bit. I see. I, no one will show up about that guy. I kind of want to. I kind of want to meet him and hang out with him. He actually seems pretty rad. All right, so I've sprayed. Yeah. Now take your large tooth. Okay. But don't make that face when you're doing it. They're gonna oh, think oh, it's so bad. Yeah. All right, and then I take my large tooth comb. Which one is that? Yes, the one with the widest teeth. Okay, so the teeth, the teeth are these thingies. The one with the widest teeth to get this. Yes, one. correct. Start at the bottom of your hair and just comb all the way up. You're just detangling oh, at this point. So easy with that main detangler. I'm gonna be I mean, Keanu Momoa. Not by the end of this. This feels good. I literally oh, haven't combed my hair in probably 10 years. Oh man, that feels really good. Now I know why dogs like yeah. it. Yeah. Oh, it's fluffy. Okay. So now, 